Alright guys, so today I'm going to talk about a setting that I never really mentioned too much about in the past. Um, I have been talking about Dead Zone a lot lately, but I'm going to kind of explain why I play 1 um, for my left and max Dead Zone uh, compared to playing like 0 for my right stick minimum because they are two different things and I'm just going to explain like why that is right now so you can decide which one you want to use or how you want to customize that, right? Alright, so pretty much right stick maximum is the time it takes for the stick to register. Your right stick, let's just say right stick for example, it reaches the maximum end of the, the stick so that it can be able to activate the, like the fastest way to turn. Alright, and that's kind of like, you know, if I was moving the right stick a little bit, you know, my right stick's gonna move a little bit, my character's gonna look a little bit. But if I was moving it a lot, my character's gonna look a lot. All right, so you looking a lot right here, like let's just say you're pushing the stick all the way to the right, you're telling the controller that you wanna reach the fastest looking possible and reach the end of that um, sensitivity that you have. Make the sensitivity like turn the fastest it could possibly turn. And pretty much if you have this low, it tells the controller that you're already looking as fast as you possibly can a lot faster than um, if you had it higher. All right, so it's, it's a little like it's hard to put it into words, but I'm just gonna like show how it works too. So right now I have a point four, right? I have it at point four, and this is how fast my my stick is turning, right? And some people like playing at point four or like just a lower maximum dead zone. Yes, you could turn fast, and technically you would be able to have faster reactions, but um the mar the margin of error I, I still don't know how to say it correctly if i'm even saying it right um that is so much higher because you're going to be turning fast all the time it's like playing on a high sensitivity all right so that's why i don't like playing on a low rate stick maximum because i want it to be as slow as possible to reach the left and right so that i can have way better aim and be able to have more accurate shots all right, and I'm, I'm going to try to like show a visual example too, right? Let's just say there's two different curves. So um, there's, there's one curve, right? Um, this is going to reflect your aim. And it goes straight up like this. That did not work how I wanted it to work, right? You have like a straight up linear curve. Right? And then you have a curve that goes up like this. All right, so if you're playing on a high right stick uh, maximum, then your curve is gonna look like more like this, a lot more accurate, and it's gonna slowly go up over time, meaning that your right stick sensitivity is slowly gonna speed up all the time the more you move your stick to the right. Now, if you have a low right stick minimum, you only need to put a minimal amount of effort for you to reach a faster, um speed at which your controller is going to be turning your character all right so um like i said uh the lower pretty much the lower it is the faster you are but it could be in a bad way because you're not going to be able to hit super far shots like this you know right now i'm on that one right that uh one max <laughs> these are big words uh the one max right stick right and this is like how my aim would be all right, like that's 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 how my aim would be. All right, and then if I have it on point four, right? This is this is how my aim would be. You see how my aim is so bad? Like you notice the difference? All right, so um, yeah, I don't I don't play on that. Some people actually do play on that, which is really ridiculous. I don't play on that. You can argue that actually, like putting your left stick max down like low-key like that's that's why but um this is why a lot of people right they just don't touch this they leave it at 0.99 i raise it to one because i know how bad it is when you turn it down like how bad it affects your aim so i always try to keep it at once so that i can have the best accuracy possible and as far as i know my aim is really good and it's gotten so much better probably because um this setting does play a part in that and since that like using the max dead zone putting it down makes you react a lot faster right like that um curve right here you go up faster then putting it for your left stick would actually make your character run a little bit faster right so um 
I'm actually going to start playing with that now. I'm going to pl be playing 0.4 max for my left stick and then keep the right stick on uh, uh, on just the highest stick that I've been having it. All right. So that is pretty much the, the max dead zones and um, how how they kind of work, like that little curve thing I showed you just to give you like a better description and um, just kind of give you a visual uh, of why I play one and a lot of people play 0.99. And from my experience and what I know, the higher you raise that maximum input dead zone for your right stick, the better accuracy you will have in this game. Also, I am going to be streaming on Kick soon when I do start my live stream so you guys can catch me on there. And you can join the Discord for um, just connecting with other people if I ever go live or anything like that. You can get notifications for that. And any of my services that you are interested in getting, you can find them on there. And also looking for people to push out uh, my services. So if you guys want to make some quick money, you can do that as well.
Survive. 